Welcome to Celebrity News and Lifestyle where we give you the right updates about music stars, sports and movie superstars, and if you're new here or this is your first time reaching out to Celebrity News and Lifestyle, please take some minutes of your time to subscribe, like, comment and hit the notification button, so that you don't miss any of your favorite news. Coco Gauff joins the chorus for opportunity in women's sports. Ahead of the start of the Mutual Madrid Open, Coco Gauff has added her voice to the growing chorus of discussions on topics such as opportunities and equal pay for female athletes in recent weeks. This conversation started spreading in our house earlier this month, after the women's college basketball tournament broke records, with the University of South Carolina beating the Caitlin Clark-led University of Iowa Hawks in the finals, surpassing the men's tournament in total viewers, and was only amplified after last week's WNBA draft. Clark was selected first overall by the Indiana Fever, and quickly went viral for the wrong reasons. Clark, the NCAA's all-time leading scorer, signed a four-year $338,056 contract with the team, increasing his base salary in his first year for only $76,535. For comparison, Victor Webanyama, the number one pick in last year's NBA draft, signed a rookie contract worth more than $1 million per year. It's not always about money, but clearly these women are paid very little relative to their workload, compared to their male counterparts Gorf said Tuesday of the campaign's members from other sports. As one of the best athletes paid in the world last year after their wallets in this field and on the field, Gorf, adults playing basketball out of tennis to tell journalists in Madrid that her parents had secondary hobbies in tennis, in addition to that to their chosen sport. His father, Korean, played basketball at the university level while his mother, Candy, joined athletics. She added that the reason she is in this position is because of her predecessors on the tennis court and the vision that was ahead of its time for many of them. I am grateful to the tennis pioneers who started this change early. Billie Jean King, the original nine, Venus Williams, they were known early on Goff said Tuesday. For example, after winning the US Open last summer, Gorf thanked Billie Jean King, who presented him with the trophy in celebration of the tournament's 50th anniversary. She celebrates the day she won a prize amounting to a record $3 million. Tennis is unique because it is a global sport. I feel like it got us to that stage very early on she continued. Even when basketball is a global sport, it still grows its roots now outside the United States related to WNBA, you see how much these women bring and carry it. Come to others, and the amount of payment, and this is very different. Michelle Obama said to me, the power of rejection is so important. People will approach you about all of this, and every opportunity seems really great. But at the end of the day, your skills are what have to come first before all of these things outside of family or religion. That. You want to continue your career. Tennis is a foundation for achieving other things, so basketball or soccer or whatever is going to be a greater foundation for other things. And be careful who you say yes to because to burn yourself out mentally. Sometimes, with the lights and cameras, you just want to be in it, but you have to balance that. Thanks for reaching out to Celebrity News and Lifestyle, and for watching our videos till the end, if there's something about this video that you like to share, please do share with us. And guys don't forget to subscribe, like, this video, share and leave your comment on the comment section below your comments, matters see you next time.